Now on to... Uh, let me get this out of the way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is going to take forever to clean up. Wii games. Another Sing game. No comment. Okay, I can talk about this. Beat the beat... Rhythm... Beat the... Oh. I just forgot about some... Other GameCube games. I forgot to talk about SA1. One sec. I am professional, I swear. <laughs> dancing Stage Mario Mix. Pretty fun uh, dancing game. Uh, pretty decently sized uh, story mode for what it is. And I remember just going through all the difficulties in the story mode. Thinking I'll unlock something cool, but... Nope. <laughs> I didn't get anything. As far as I remember. Super Mario Sunshine. It, it's flawed. It does have some questionable things here, but I still really enjoy it. Much more than 3D Land. I'll give it that. I'll say that. I don't dislike 3D Land, but I just... I'm just not a fan. I, I just don't like how... Uh, 3D, 3D Land and 3D World are more like a 2D game built, built uh, for a 3D game or something. It's like it doesn't appeal to me as much. But yeah, Sunshine, good game, but flawed. Luigi's Mansion, really enjoyed this one. Uh, enjoyed this one a lot more than the second game because again, atmosphere is spawn. I really enjoy collect. Uh, Sucking up the ghosts. I really love the idea of the portrait ghosts, and I hate the fact that they're not in the second game. Um, collecting the money just feels so much more fun and satisfying here, in my opinion. And it's just tons more fun to find secrets, I feel. Wind Waker. Really, really enjoy this, uh, enjoy this game. It's one of my favorite Zelda games. Um, the in the original, the sailing can get kind of tiring when you have to go uh, go places that are really far. But I don't play this one anymore. I play the HD remake because it fixed that. But as far as the other stuff, I really, I well, I enjoy the I enjoy the dungeons. Um, I like just exploring the uh, world, seeing what's out there, and just. There's a lot of content to this game, and it's a ton of fun. The Incredibles the video game. It's a decent licensed game, but there are some things in it that just drive me nuts. Um, like, it, the difficulty in, like, it's not too bad for me now because of experience, experience, but, oh man, this game doesn't know the word mercy sometimes. Super Smash Bros. Melee. I don't really need to say anything. It's freaking Melee. Rise of the Underminer. I think it's better than the first game because it's more it, it's more direct in what it wants to do and I think it does a decent enough job. And it doesn't have stupid difficulty spikes. Sonic Heroes. Love this game. I think it's criminally underrated. Um, I love the team aspect. I really enjoy most... I, well, I enjoy most of the stages. Um, I'm not the biggest fan I get to play the same game four times. But I enjoy this game so much that I don't really... It doesn't really bother me too much when I play it. Um... Yeah, love this game. <laughs> Star Wars The Clone Wars. Really, really fun game. I The campaign is a quite... A, it, the, the campaign's pretty fun. Multiplayer gets really, really addictive. And, yeah. If you enjoy the multiplayer, you'll be out at this for hours. Trust me. Sonic Adventure DX. Not as good as SA2 in my opinion, but I still really, really enjoy this game. Um, I like, 
I like what it did for the Sonic series in general. Um, I like the multiple pl multiple playable characters. Um, I like the hub world and all these di the different locations in them. And yeah, there's a lot to like in this game. There's also a mission mode that's quite a, quite a lot of fun and a game gear collection which is really cool okay now for actual re Wii games this time beat the beat rhythm paradise I'm just making sure okay okay yeah that's the last of the Wii games oh. gamecube games ah. beat the beat rhythm paradise for what I played I haven't finished this game yet but for what I played Ton of fun. Um, probably, yeah, I, I want to say I like this one more than the DS one. Um, yeah, it's, it's fun. <laughs> Wario Land, a shake dimension. Also known, as, also known as Shake It. Really fun game. Really fun platformer. I love shaking things to death. <laughs> and... Chucking them away, and yeah, there's still a lot of stuff I haven't done in this game. I need to get back to this at some point. We fit. It's we fit. Donkey Kong Country Returns. Awesome, awesome game. I really. I kind of want to, I kind of want to, don't kill me for this, but I kind of want to say I prefer the rare, rare not rare, <laughs> wrong company, Retro Studios' take on Donkey Kong Country more than rare, um, rare's version, but I don't know, it's just something about it, something about it, I just feel I'm more in control, and, yeah, I don't know, I just enjoy them more. Marion Sonic Olympic Winter Games. I said that weird. I don't know. <laughs> um, it's a decent mini game collection. There. This is all messed up. All torn apart. I guess that's what you expect when the game is red for blood. And all this other stuff that's been joked about before several times. Mario Wii. I like this game, but it's definitely the start. It was definitely the start of 2D Mario rehashes. Oh, yes. Rayman Origins. I really love this game. It did everything the Rayman 1 did. Well, actually, no. Well, it changed quite a lot. But it did... It used the basic formula of Rayman 1. But up, upped it to the umpteenth degree. Like, this is just amazing stuff. Like, some of the best 2D platforming you'll ever see. Sonic and the Black Knight, underrated as well, there are so, I'm a broken record at this stage, but there are so many Sonic games that are so criminally underrated, and again, this is one of them, I don't know, I don't know why people hate this game, but I think it's one of the, one of the better games, um, I really enjoy playing this one, there are tons of missions to do after you beat the game, uh, the battle mode is kind of hit and miss, but, who really plays Sonic games for the multiplayer, besides SA2? Um, but yeah, I think the single player is a solid experience. Metroid of Ram. <laughs> I don't... I, I'm enjoying this game enough. I'm... I don't know how far I'm in the game, but I'm a decent amount through the game. Um, I'm, joy I'm enjoying it fine enough. But yeah, I will agree with the story being pretty bad. <laughs> Kirby's Adventure Wii. 
Return to Dreamland, or as I like to call it, Kirby Wii. Um, because it's just easier. Yeah. I, I like this game more than Triple Deluxe. I don't know why, but I just have more, more fun with this one. Um, most of my, uh, thing, most of the things I said about Triple Deluxe, uh, stay true of this game as well. I really love the level design. The, uh, music is one of the best in the series, I think. Or the, the soundtrack. Um, I like the super, super abilities. Um, what else is there? I enjoy the mini games. Oh yeah, there's also the bonus, cha the uh, copy ability challenges, which are pretty fun. And yeah, really good, really, really solid Kirby. Rabbits go home. I think it's the best rabbits game. I think, but I still think it's kind of average. Like, well, it's better than average. I'll give it that. It's not bad, but it gets really tiring really quickly. It's there. It, it just becomes really samey. Tatsunoko, Tatsunoko versus Capcom, or whatever you, how you, you say it. I need to stop doing this as well, but <laughs> uh, yeah. I haven't played this game that much, but from what I have played, it's pretty fun. Skyward Sword. This is actually a really, really good game in my opinion. I love this game. Um, say what you will about the motion controls, and it does it doesn't do everything a hundred percent like perfectly, but I think it's a good game. Actually, no, scratch that. I think it's an amazing game. Lego Star Wars 3, The Clone Wars. I am actually watching The Clone Wars as we speak. Um, but as far as the... Um, and, well, I'm really enjoying The Clone Wars show. It's everything the prequels wish they were, and then some. And as far as the game goes, it's, pr it's still really good. I don't know if I like this or the originals more, but... Yeah, I like this one too, but it does have some questionable design choices. Alright, D Blob. Pretty fun game. Uh, has some interesting multiplayer game, uh, multiplayer mode that I don't remember anything about, but yeah, it's a, it's a game. Lego Harry Potter years one to four, or Lego Harry Potter one. Um, it's a it's an excellent Lego game. I don't enjoy this as much as the Lego Star Wars stuff, but it's still a really good game in terms of like general design. This is miles better than the Lego Star Wars games, um, well the ones I've shown at least. But yeah, I just I just prefer Star Wars over Harry Potter. So yeah. Mario Party 8. Mm. Eh. D Blob 2. I haven't played too much of this, so I can't really say much. This is the same game again. What? Why are the two why do I have two Olympic Winter games? Whatever, I'm just skipping. I'm just gonna skip that. <laughs> Super Paper Mario. I really enjoyed this game. It took, me, it took a while for me to uh, get into it, but when I did, I really got into it. It's a really, really fun game. I love the story. It's one of the best in the uh, Mario stories. Um, and while the game, the get main gameplay can be repetitive, I still find it really fun. Okay. The original Olympic Games, which I isn't actually ours. Uh, the guy that gave us this never gave, never asked for it again. So I guess we unofficially have it. Uh, but yeah, not nowhere near as good as the sequels, but it's okay. Uh, 
Another Disney Sing It game, no comment. If you could only see this. <laughs> Sonic Rider Zero Gravity. I haven't played this one yet, but I'm really looking forward to this. I'm really looking forward to playing it. Wii Sports. I remember when the Wii came out, I played this game like no one's business. I remember like at some state at some point um I tried playing single player stuff and then it's like it's so funny cuz like back then every time you played the Wii, someone was there. Someone was there to play with you. Like it was it was just kind of it was cool but hilarious. Punch out Wii. One of the more recent games in the Wii collection. I really love this game. Like I think it's everything that the other games did and then some. Like, I, I think this is the best game in the series. There's so much to this game. The characters are great. And yeah. If you want my full summary of this game, watch my review. Because a lot of the stuff I say in that still stands. Band Hero. Never played this one. Chicken Little Ace in Action. Haven't played this one in years, but I remember getting stuck stuck in it, and it's kind of. It has some weird design choices. Like you, you like aim. You aim like normal with the uh, cursor, thing, the uh, sensor bar, and all that. The thing is though, to move the camera. You have to like move the sensor bar to like the side of the screen so it turns or something. And it's just so weird. Guitar Hero World Tour. I haven't played the Guitar Hero games that much, but Yeah, they're fun. <laughs> Super Smash Bros. Bro. I don't enjoy this one as much as Melee, not because of the speed or the tripping or anything like that, but because I prefer most of the modes in Melee, besides maybe Subspace, because that was... It's much better going through that compared to the same adventure mode like 25 times, but yeah, I just prefer the target target test in Melee, the, um, <laughs> the, event, the event mode, the classic mode I enjoy tons more. Um, All-Star mode, I like the uh, unpredictability of the melee one, because Brawl and Smash 4 are scripted, but, um, yeah, I just, I enjoy melee more, but this, I can't deny that, I can't deny the genius that is Super Smash Bros. Brawl, this is also an excellent game. Mario and Sonic at the London 2012 Olympic Games, because they can't make these ga names any shorter. Yeah. Definitely my favourite in the series. I need to play this game again, because I remember, ha remember having a ton of fun. Sonic and the Secret Rings. Indifferent towards this one, but... I don't think it's as bad as people make it out to be. Ignore that little sticker on it, but Boom Blocks Bash Party. My copy is bugged because it doesn't save any any uh, further into the game, but it's a really really fun party game, and it's just so much fun to mess around and make your own levels and stuff. Epic Mickey. Really good game. Um, it doesn't go like it's not like the best game ever but I think it's I really like the morality system I think it's one of the best morality systems um, in a game that I've played but yeah Lego Star Wars a complete saga um, yeah this is one of my def definitely one of my favorite Lego games because it's one and two combined with even more and you can't go wrong with that. 
Wii Sports Resort. Really, really excellent upgrade to Wii Sports. There's so much to this game. You could be at it for hours trying to unlock everything. And there's so much fun to be had here. <coughs> like the doing sword jewels is so much fun. I had so much fun playing that with Callum. Um, and the ten table tennis is miles better than what the tennis in the original game ever had. And there's so much more. Like There's tons of fun in this. We fit plus. We fit more. Animal Crossing, let's go to the city, also known as City Folk. Um, better game, but as I've said before, not really an Animal Crossing guy. I'll just switch these around. Alright. Super Mario Galaxy. Ignore the stuff on it, but <laughs> yeah. Amazing game. There's the music's great, level design's amazing. Um I like the that they try to be more cinematic with this one. Um Yeah. What else can I say? It's freaking Mario Galaxy. Mario Galaxy 2. Love this one. It's one of my favorite games of all time. Like Banjo Tui, this is one of the few games that I consistently that I can consistently say that is my favorite one of my favorite games of all time. Did I say it was my favorite game of all time? I don't know what is my favorite game of all time, definitely, but this is one of them. This is one of my top games and it's it's basically everything the first game was but more but so, the story is downgraded for sure but everything else i think is upgraded to the 10th degree like i think it's amazing can be so big yarn i actually plan to play this game uh, for the channel soon really soon actually very relaxing game um, fun Kirby game, um, if a, if a bit easy, um, but as for, as far as Kirby games go, that's basically the, basically the norm, but, yeah, it's a, it's a fun game. Super Monkey Ball Banana Blitz, fun for the first three or four worlds, and then for my taste, it gets just too ridiculous for the motion controls. Sonic Colors, love this game. Really, really love this game. I actually enjoy this one more than Generations, but that's just me. Sonic Unleashed for the Wii. Um, I haven't played this one in quite a while, but I remember enjoying it quite a lot. Oh, it's finishing with the original Pikmin, okay. Pikmin 1. I f yeah I, I enjoy this one more than two. Um, I think it's really really fun to get more Pikmin, and it's fun to try and manage things and try and finish the game as soon as you can. And yeah, I think it's a it's a ton of fun to play. Okay, so I'll be right back, and uh, when I come back, I will be with the PS3 and Wii U stuff.